going on everybody? It's Big Time Beeline here. Today we are doing the 4K Samsung 20 inch monitor setup. This is the newer model, the one with the E in it. It's 28 inches. And yep, so first thing you want to do, you want to make sure your HDMI is on the second one, not the first. So just make sure it's on the second and you're all good. And this is connected. This is the standard PS4 HDMI cable, nothing fancy. Just want to come with. A PS4. I have an off right now. I have the monitor set up as so. So I'm just gonna click the power button and hold it to set it into rest mode or the weird startup mode. So that's two beeps. And you only want to connect an HDMI cable. I don't know where I put mine. I'm not prepared for videos. Ah! it I think it's at my feet no that's my other one. Oh, I think it's this one yeah we'll just roll with that one so I don't mind that so we're just gonna go no don't connect the phone you idiot connect the controller <laughs> ah nope that's the one so yep, so now it's all connected, hold the power button, and you go to set HDCP mode. And you set it to this one right here, HDCP 1.4 only, hit OK, and then hit OK, and then we shall continue to start up the PS4. That's pretty much like all you gotta do. Just make sure it's in the second socket. Standard HDMI cable. And it should boot up. It might not be in 4K natively, but the options will appear as I will show. I believe this is the way it is. If not, then just leave a comment and I will try to troubleshoot. Because I might have done something initially different. I don't think I did anything with the monitor. It's just, it's just the PS4 Pro. And since this is an older monitor with HTCP 1.4, this is what it supports. But it is supported, so that's the good news if you have this monitor and a PS4 Pro. And it looks pretty nice, one millisecond response time. So yeah, you just gotta go up and go to settings. And then go to sound and system screen. Yep. Sorry about like the light on my phone. It's making a nice little like dot, but whatever. You get the gist. Do yeah, I'll put settings? You go to resolution. These two should appear. Click on RGB because UV 420 is for HDR content. We don't have HDR monitor, do we? Nope. So that's all you got to do. And then sound the screen. And then, yep. Yeah. And then here's the information. If you don't believe it, it's just 3.4. Yeah, whatever, it's 384 times 160, 60 hertz, RGB, not supported. And that's all she wrote. And yeah, that's how you set it up. If you have any questions, again, leave them in the comments. Peace.